let's see what's happening on the back stretch. I will tell you what's happening. I'm talking with Jeff Cox, and he is the trainer of the one Nukes Fantasy, of course, the morning line choice in this upcoming Breeders' Championship race. And, Jeff, they were just talking, uh, actually, about the Malones and sending out nice young individuals. There actually is a connection between the Malones and your horse, Nukes Fantasy. Yeah, we bought the Nukes Fantasy off of Guy back around May. All right, so you've had this one since May, and she's been doing a lot of winning for you. As a matter of fact, she's a winner of 7 of 11 this year and is currently on a four-race win string. Very, very sharp. Is it easy to keep a two-year-old filly that sharp? Well, it depends on She's got a good attitude, so that helps her. A good attitude. Is there anything that you have to do as a trainer to keep a filly happy? No, the groom does all the jobs. It's up to him. All right, when you say that, a key element then to your success is hiring the right people, the key people. What kind of a groom do you look for when you're dealing with fillies? Anything special? Well, um, Vaughn takes care of this one. He's real easy with horses, doesn't get excited, and makes him happy. A nice, quiet hand. Well, that sounds good. You know, we talk about everything that goes into creating a winning horse, and certainly it's not just the conditioning by the trainer. You mentioned the groom, but also you have to choose a driver to sit behind your horse. Todd Jones has been handling Nukes Fantasy. Do you try to fit the driver to the horse, or you just use one guy and stick with one guy because of convenience with communication? Well, I try to stick with one guy, but uh, if they can't get along with one, then you change. With Dave going out of town, I had to look for somebody else, and we hooked up with Todd and done real well. Yes, you did. Of course, uh, almost the name Miller and Cox were synonymous. Uh, you and David Miller made quite a team here. Going out of town, you were instrumental in helping him make that move. Is it one you regret now that he's away? Yeah, but it was best for him. It was best for him. That's very magnanimous of you to say, Jeff. Today, uh, back at Nukes Fantasy and Todd Jones, um, have you had a chance to chat with David about anything or even about Nukes Fantasy? No, really. I don't really talk about the horse. I just let him race and see afterwards. Well, she looks like quite a standout. However, it's always a race. What about strategy for this one going postward? Uh, me and Todd haven't even talked about it. So I know the six horse is real nice, and the four horse can be nice. So it'll be a, it'll be a tough race. It will always be a race. Well, thanks, Jeff, for taking time out to talk to me about Nukes Fantasy. And, of course, good luck. Thank you. And thank you. The very long-winded Jeff Cox added again in the backstretch. Uh, barrel of laughs, but he's a heck of a trainer, I'll tell you that.